Okay, so you've pulled it in neutral and you're feeling it. And tell me what you feel. I'm feeling the boat's not slowing down, but I am drifting a bit to the to the, the port side. The, the bow is at least. The bow's going a little port. Now it's coming back to starboard. Did you change your steering wheel? No, I'm right on neutral. Okay. Now the stern is moving to port and the bow is to right. So the That's down. the wind on the cabin on the back of the boat. I would bow thrust to the port. There you go. Bow thrust again. So the wind behind us is at least 15 to maybe 20 it's and it's blowing us. on the cabin. It's still carrying us to three knots. Okay, put it in reverse and slow us down. And remember we will walk right in reverse so we're counteracting our landing procedure, but we, we, we have to slow the boat down. Yep. Okay, put it in neutral and let the wind carry us. And toggle between the bow thruster and the stern thruster to get us close. Because you've got to get the stern close to the cleat to tie the boat up. Okay, slow us down, put it reverse, slow us down. More reverse, more reverse. More reverse. Wrap it around the cleat, bring it back tight on the boat. Okay, tight on the boat. Stern thrust port, stern thrust port. Pull in the slack. Okay, tie it on, tie it on. Tie it, you cannot fight it, tie it. Okay, the stern cleat is on. And we've got one, two, three, four fenders. We do not have a fender on the bow, so take the bow thruster out a little bit. No, so put that walking finger down low to keep the shear line of the bow from going across the top of the dock. Bring it back to the Portuguese bridge where the boat's fatter. Did you tie that knot so it won't blow away in a hurricane? Okay, bring it back to the Portuguese bridge. Good? No, no back. You come all the way stern. Come backwards to the Portuguese bridge. Okay, right about there. And lower it down to where the floating dock is. And we'll kiss. You'll see where to kiss. Okay, and tie it right there. So that's the proper length going down and the proper part of the boat before the boat curves over to the bow, the pointed part of the boat. Fendered there. We're fendered, so you can step away from the helm. So what do you think? How was that? That worked, that worked pretty well. Okay. It's better, it better than the first time, so improvement is good. That's why I didn't video the first time. Okay, so let's stop and we'll talk about it. Come up here and we'll have a little debriefing. I was glad I was able to do that. Okay. Now notice we only have one dock line on because the wind is holding us in place. If we were going to stay any longer, we could put out more dock lines. Can I talk here? You want me to talk there? I'll come up here so we don't have to yell.